all right welcome back to this video in this video i'll be showing you how to edit your website in case you are not doing the auto post maybe you just want to set up a website for your company or for a client now you see now i want to change how we can change our change this one and put our own change this banana and put our good own products change all of this thing and put our own change the name and put our own logo and the rest phone number and the rest so let me go back to the dashboard first place to go is to go to appearance then go to customize so you click on customize So once you click on customize, now you go to general, you edit the site, then okay, this is where you change the logo. This this thing you are seeing is called Favicon. Favicon. That's F A V then icon. Fab icon. So you can remove it. it it's this it here. You see this place. So you can change it and put your own. So I don't have one to put now so I'll go back then the home page okay uh, home page leave home page then post page press leave this ones uh, then the letter newsletter newsletter is something that pop up once you load this site let's go load this site okay you can edit it it depends on the team you are using but this team has a newsletter pop up then something that pop up that pop up so that they can collect people's uh, data so that's for that then go back typography the font you can change the font size you can the body you can change these settings but i'll advise you to leave it the way they are then the headline you can change it if you if you like can change some setting the black this black to this black color you can change it the color these are the color of the site you can change it header you can change it just play around with it you play around then you publish you check the footer this is what they call footer this part is called footer the last part is called footer so go back then go back then all right then you will click on star let's see star general so you can play around with this thing change something this um enable lazy load. lazy load means once they come on your website it's keep loading 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 until it's load it's fully load so you can do that then you can um do the color scheme these are the color scheme and go back either then promotion 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 if you have a promotion you put it on logo this is where you put your logo this stuff this stuff here is the logo uh, you change it <coughs> excuse me then header this this whole part is called the header so i can change it full with it. enable top bar and something after this logo top bar so i don't want it so just play around with the customize customizer no customizing okay so once you change all of this thing, hot link, this is the hot link. You change the phone number to whatever you want. Let's see, there is zero. There is zero. So you change the hot link to, to whatever you want. Then you click on publish. It will change it. You see this lazy load. That's all right. Okay.
Okay, go back, cut, leave this one, then account, leave this one, skin, add skin, the color, you can change the color, you can change everything. That's for either WooCommerce. WooCommerce, I told you WooCommerce will allow you to sell. So, page product page the size of the uh, the image you can use you can resize it to whatever you want i will advise you to leave the way they are just leave them the way they are then catalog you can change you can just play around with it it depends on your website what the kind of website you want to build you tell me what you're going to do here mobile do the same thing to mobile then save it and that's all okay yeah that's all okay those are just the setting the minor minor settings now let's go to the major settings the major settings are somewhere something like you want to put your own product you want to change this place and uh, this widget and the rest so how do we do that? We go to Woo, we go to product under Woo, products, all products. And you're gonna see all the products now. These are the products. So you can remove these products and put your own. Okay, and you can also edit it. Let's assume I want to put one product now. You can say add product. But if you are doing a website that does not require now just put the name of the product here let's say testing that's the name of my product then description of the product this product is uh, this product is for female so just put the description then here put the regular price sales price Regular price could be let's say the regular price is ten thousand. New prices five thousand. Then sales quality. How many do you have? How many products? Let's say we have like we have hundred sold twenty. So, categories. What category of product is it? Uh, is it TV? Is it okay? Brand. This is brand. What brand? You can put the brand if you have any brand. Let's just say US store. Then the category. Uh, let's say it's fruits. Then featured. This is the product image the product image you can upload the product image I just want to use the uh, library so I'll pick one product from here then say select image then here short description about the product ladies fruits ladies fruits then um, description description okay 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 so you will put in here fixed description just put something about the description of the product so that's it so the next thing you're just doing is publish let's preview and see our product You see, five thousand, then ten thousand is the normal price, regular price, then six price is five thousand. This is the product. Then they can add to card description, you know, then description, 
description description related products so that's it so i can save it and uh, save it and that's all but i'm not going to save it because i'm just using that to test test run it so that's this uh, editing or if you want if you want to edit it you just edit it here but if you are doing a website that is not WooCommerce website i mean you are not selling anything you don't need all this all you just need to do is go to your page so let's do page now let's do page editing now let's edit our page or oh, the pages so let's see this is the front page that's your home page you are seeing this place you are seeing let me show you this place is called the home page so how do we edit it change all this 24 247 support and all of that so if i click on edit let me open your another tab okay now see so you can edit it from here this thing you're seeing this resolution slider is this this big banner that's the resolution slider <coughs> excuse me then this stuff this this is an empty space between these just empty space between these and resolution slider between this icon and resolution slider so let's see what is the icon about? Okay, this is the icon. This space. Let me draw it so that you can see it. This space. This space. That's what you you are seeing here. This is it. This is what is responsible for that space. Then the icon you are seeing is this icons. So you just click on it and edit it. So how do we edit it? Just click here, click on this pencil. Then you wait for, for it to load. You can see the icons. That uh, free delivery. And um, so if you want to edit that, just click on this one change the icon change the word if you have another word for it save it then let's move down then we have another space then we have headline custom headline that's another space custom headline that's top categories of the month so they have the products in boxes image Product, 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 product. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. These are the products, and this thing is that is a space between this. Let us space. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see, maybe six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Can you see? Then we have two banners. Two banners. Here you are banner medium banner medium then space space okay then we have space then we have product deal carousel that means carousel is something that is flippable can you see product deal carousel we have that then we have top we have this top list product list carousel which is this Top 20. Then we have new arrival. One, two, three, four, five. New arrival. New arrival. Then here are the product. New arrival. Then, then we have testimonies as testimonial slide. What people are saying. 
you see what client says to then we have post then we have space let's see the post this is a post news there is space and that's all so that's how you edit it just click the pencil to edit and change whatever is there change what you want change everything here and you save it so that's what you would do to all the pages if you, change, if you want to change um about us let's try about us and that will be the end of this video so let me click on all pages so i will click on all pages then i'll click on edit about us let's edit about us let's edit about us and see So here is the bottles. We have single image. Then we have space. We have custom headline. We have space. We have custom headline. We have space. Then we have uh, the word. So let me show you. Let me show you this. See? single image that custom headline the custom headline then the word is then um, discovery journey I mean, discovery math phrase journey then meets so meets our leader so here yeah, discovery journey this is the countdown discovery journey see I meet our leaders then we have the photo and then we have this partner so that will be end of this uh, video I just want to urge you to watch it and make use of it bye for now